डू यू नो हाउ ए आई एजेंट कैन स्क्रेप डेटा फ्रॉम वेब एंड हाउ टू फ्यूज फायर क्रॉल एंड कम्पोजियो विद ए आई एजेंट सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम एक्सप्लेन यू ऑल ऑफ दिस हाई गाइज वेलकम टू फ्री बर्ड्स व्यू एंड लेट्स क्रिएट अवर इलेवंथ ए आई एजेंट दैट यूज फायर क्रॉल ए पी आई टू स्क्रेप द वेब फॉर योर टास्क एंड यूजिंग कम्पोजियो विल बिल्ड एन एक्सेल शीट फॉर यू बाई वर्किंग एज टूल्स फॉर योर ए आई एजेंट एज वेल एंड हेयर इज अ शॉर्ट डेम ऑफ द प्रोजेक्ट एज यू सी When I search for gaming PCs, it searches the web, find the top ten links for me with description, image, price, and link, and make Excel sheet at the end, so so that you can store the data as well. And in the other project that can scrape the jobs for you as per your query, and at the end show you the jobs with info, with links, location, along with the job apply link as well, and you can make it into the Excel sheet as well. So let's create these two projects. First, let me tell you about the Firecall. API. So Firecall API enables developer to crawl the website, extract the structured data, and understand the web page content using artificial intelligence without needing to write any complex scraping logic for each site as well. And it is used to extract the content like text, metadata, links, images from the web pages. It it used to automate the web data collection for the uses like the SEO research. market analysis like that and to understand the content using ai not just the raw html but also the actual content on the site as well and you can install it by using the pip install firecrawl hyphen py in the python command prompt and here is the overview of the firecrawl website and its documentation link is in the description for you to use as well then we have the compose you ai that is the tool set for ai agents and llms designed to streamline and optimize the connection and interaction between the ai agents and the different api services including the google apps github slack and system tools like code interpreter file management or the database as well it has more than 250 plus tools available on its website and you can install it by using pip install compose you hyphen core in your python command prompt and here is the overview of the compose you website and its documentation and i will surely put the link in the description for you to use now now get all the prerequisites of this project listen and learn carefully first you need to have the knowledge about the ai agents what are they how they work and what are the agent design patterns you have to watch my these two videos of ai agents and get yourself familiar with with the ai agent workflows and designs after all this is done let's create our 11th ai agent and that can scrape anything for you from web and create the actual sheet for that as well or oh guys so here is our the first scrapping agent that use the a uh, firecrawl api along with the compose you api to scrape the amazon products with the product title price image urls along with the descriptions as well from the amazon website okay it will work how first we uh, import all our necessary libraries here we use the agno identity uh, ai framework to build our ai agents and use the firecrawl api here okay so first we need to like uh, make a firecrawl api initialization here as well and when that is done we have to make the schema for the amazon product data we need the product title we need the price we need the image url and the description this will get return in the uh, web scrapping okay so for that we first build a uh, fetching function here that use the uh, headers like this Th this is the very static thing that you have to put there as well because it use that thing and then we have to create our sessions here for in this session it will try to go on the amazon website and try to search for our search term that we search like we search for the watches clothes uh, gaming consoles anything like that okay and for that uh, for that it it will try to get that uh, thing for us and after that thing is here we need to uh, scrape all the important information out of it as well okay it will try to get search about the everything that that, that we need like the asin uh, numbers because for that asin numbers as well we get the product links okay so for that product product links it will try to return that in the end and for from and, and for that product links it will then use those product links here okay because we put all the product links like all the urls that we get in that process the firecrawl api will process those links and find this a uh, structured informations for us that we just put put it right down there okay so for that we just uh, uh, handed over the top 10 uh, 
uh, URLs here and for that uh, URLs it is trying to extract the information like title, price, image and uh, description as well. We we'll try to pass the website URL and we'll get the data and in the return we get the structured form of data as well. Okay, and this structured form of data, we try to put it into the Excel sheet at the end. Okay, so for that, we need to call our compo Composio toolset. And from that Composio toolset, we need the Google sheet form that will made out of the JSON response as well because this information is into the JSON form. Okay, so for that, we first try to make an AI agent for that google sheet because we tool this composio set as a a tool for our agno ai agent as well okay so for that we pass the instruction here you are expert as creating creating actual sheets you are given the json info and try to write it into the actual sheet as well so whenever it will get the information it will try to write it in into the actual sheet as well so for that we create a full prompt here we pass our formatted the data and call over this AI agent and we can pass over this whole message with the formatted data and try to create the Excel sheet as well with this kind of link. Okay, it will try to give us a link at the end like a sheet link. We have to pass this uh, sheet link here. Okay, so that we can get a full link of the uh, Google Docs file. Okay, so for that we just try to create a UI here that will work in the streamlet for the same first it fast products then it extract the data it can format data it can create the google sheet and then it will give us the final result here okay, so that's how this whole uh, ai agent to extract or scrape the amazon product info will work okay so let's see how it works in the real time this i already write here the gaming pcs okay like scrape the products when i do it it's starting fetching the informations and from that information it try to find the 77 products and from that we need the top 10 and it will extracting the top uh, top 10 products for us and building an actual sheet for us we see the link here and I, I will show you the whole products here in some time okay as you see that it extracted some products here okay that uh, these are the top 10 products we see you see the description image URL the price the title everything is right down here now it's giving us the link as well it is create it is currently creating the google sheet for us uh google sheet is already created here let's o open the sheet uh, as you see that all these top 10 links are added into that see all these top 10 links are already there with the website links as well yeah we need to create like we need to clean some uh data there as well but it will work really really best for you we just need to sort out some of the prompts or we need to create uh, we need to like remove the du duplicates uh, here as well but yeah it will try to give you the best result possible as you see we open this link here is the result of your gaming pc okay so that's how it actually works i hope this really help you to know that how you can scrape the data from the online uh, websites by you your firecrawl api as well okay and now now let's move to our next ai agent that is the job search ai agent as well oh okay, guys so here is our google job search ai agent okay let's see how this code works okay so here is the code of our uh, ai agent so here is the code of our job search ai agent we need the firecrawl library we need the agno agentic ai uh, framework as well along with the composio apis to for the tools of the google sheets as well okay we need the google api key and then we need to set our this uh, streamlit ui framework we ask for the queries number of results along with the firecrawl api and then we need the uh, like a ses uh, state sessions of the streamlit to make it more uh, dynamic as well and we need these fields the google search results we need these fields the query the title url and the snippets along with the query and the results because these query and the results are about to find from the google as well okay so whenever we search on the google these two things will matter and when we want to put the result in the sheet these three things will matter okay so first we need to search for the search thing we put our this api crawl and call this uh, a search api here we try to put our query we try to get the number of results and store this results in the response option and then we try to 
like uh, get all this uh, uh, jobs information extracted out of this response by using the file crawl we extract the title url snippet from the google search result page as well okay so that's all thing are gonna uh, extracted from this uh, kind of a, uh, response as well and we need to format it in the same way as we've format in the past okay and then we have to uh, make a clean sheet and then we have to call our uh, file crawl a API all the function, the search, the extract, the format, and then we have to uh, call our com compose your set to make our uh, compose your set Google sheet from the GJSON response. We make we uh, create our AI agent that will do the uh, Google sheet creation for you. And then whenever you got this thing, you create to just run this uh, google sheet ai agent and then you just pass all the formatted data into it and it will generate the actual sheet for you and all the code just same as the past as well we just need to change over this uh, formatted structures only that okay so let's see how it works in the real time so we first we have this hiring data scientist we need approximately let's say uh, seven results and we need to enter our firecrawl api let's copy the firecrawl api from our past app okay we just put it right down we just put uh, we just put it right down there this is our api just copy and paste and just enter it it is the same yeah okay now search google and when you click on search google it will try to fetch these kind of jobs for you and it will try to uh, show you on the screen in the form of a data frame as well okay so the 43 results that it got in there are like multiple results are there many results are i think uh duplicates as well but yeah these results are there we have to save it to the google sheet and we click here it will try to save it into the google sheet as well and give you the google sheet link and here is the link of the google sheet we just open it all the jobs are saved here exactly right there as okay so that's how you can create your own google job search here you can uh, convert this thing into the you can easily convert this uh, uh, linkedin uh, job search into the actual linkedin job search you can just uh, uh, change this uh, structure that you want from the linkedin you want to search job directly on the linkedin and you can get all the job links along with the their uh, titles their past time to post as well every little nuance detail you can get from this firecrawl api as well okay so i hope you guys clearly understand that how this uh, firecrawl api will let you scrape anything from the web by using just natural language as well and in our next video we'll try to build a research assistant with the help of open ai agents sdk toolkit okay here we don't use agno we don't use autogen we directly use the open ai agents sdk and build a research assistant for you that will run with the help of guardrails with the help of tools with the help of handoffs as well it will try to build a multi-agent system for you Okay, so just be with it. If you want to know more about the uh, generative AI, prompt engineering, data science, and machine learning, you can watch my videos on YouTube and also read my blogs on Medium. We'll meet in the next video. Thanks, guys. Thanks so much.